ladies and gentlemen, this is Tim Dow for Living With MS in Tenerife. You've probably been watching my YouTube shorts where I'm on the balcony every day showing you what I have for breakfast and dinner, of course, in the evening. And a lot of people have asked me of how I make these shorts, and so I've decided to put together a little behind the scenes, and I hope you enjoy it. Here we go. Set up for the 360 degree camera, and you listen to the original sound, and now you're listening to the recorded sound. So today's the 1st of March, and it's day 51. Yeah, yeah. So I've got to set the camera to take standard video at 5.7k. <clears throat> It's the 1st of March, 2022, and this is day 51 of the diet. As you can see, day 51 starts a new era. It's now muesli for breakfast and fruit. The sun is shining. There are people in the pool. Or they were a minute ago. Lagomera is still in mist, but we can see the mountains defined pretty well. But this, my friends, is breakfast. So now I change it to the um, time lapse. Standard time lapse. And once it's on time lapse, I can just let it go. So I can, uh, I usually turn off the microphone now, but I'm not going to do that now because I'm talking to you guys. <laughs> I'll see you in a minute. So we're back in the room and you're on the table now. So now I take photos with my iPhone. So I'll just uh, clean the lens, professional lens cleaner. And I go to portrait and I take an upright one and then a sideways one. And then I take an upright slow motion, starting about here, and I come down and then move across. So that should do. And uh, that's the end of the breakfast one. Now I can tuck in. Mr. Studio. This is going to drag the files off the camera. I'm going to import all. A little colour wheel there is just getting it ready. So it's going to bring all the stuff in here. And we've got three. We've got... Um, this is the original that I did. And you can play that. It's the 1st of March, 2022. And so what we're going to do, we're going to go back to the beginning and we're going to take this out to 9 out of 16. And start this again. Stop it right there. Cut it to the beginning and put in a keyframe. Now I can set this keyframe up to have a different field of view. So I'm going to go to the natural view which puts me about there, and I'm just going to put me around about there. And I'll play. It's the 1st of March, 2022, and this is day 51 of the diet. Now, just before I go zoom, I'm going to do a keyframe. So in between these two keyframes now, there is going to be um, a static shot. So this frame and this frame are going to be the same. It hasn't moved. So when I go to zoom, zoom. Okay, so I stop at the end of zoom. I add another keyframe, but now I want to change it. So from this keyframe to this keyframe, I want to change it the the way it looks. So I'm going to go to tiny planet. That puts me right up there. Then I'm going to bring this down like that. Zoom out a little bit. Okay, that's a bit too far. Just so that the uh, the world at the bottom looks a little bit round. There you go. 
and now play a little bit a bit more. As you can see, day 50. I'm going to put a keyframe in here and zoom back down like that. And that looks good. And now we're going to go a bit further. One starts a new era. It's now muesli for breakfast. So I want to stop here and put a keyframe there so it doesn't change between this keyframe and this keyframe. And now I want to move. So, and fruit. The sun is so when I stand up now, I want to be looking over here. So I'll put in a keyframe. I'll say fish eyes. It's a bit wider there. And just because the seas, I've noticed I've got to turn it to let's say one degree and then that's more flat now so uh, that'll come out like there that people in the pool as soon as I say the word pool I've noticed because <laughs> I say it every day uh, that's another time for a keyframe now I want a very short period Ooh. so I've got this short period here now add a new keyframe and go back to a tiny planet and I've got to bring me round like that and down and that'll give us and go out slightly uh, like that so that gives us the tiny planet look that I'm going for and then I want to keep that one for three or four seconds well, they were a minute ago Okay, so I've kept that one. So you could, really, you've got to put two keyframes in, and uh, in between those keyframes is where it's going to move. So if you want things to stay, you have to put a keyframe and then a keyframe afterwards, and don't move anything. And then when you do it again, and they are still in mist, but we can see the mountain. And I can keyframe this one again, and now come back down to me like this, and go to fisheye. And uh, where am I? There I am. And now I go a bit further. Things defined pretty well. So that's gone past me now, but I put a keyframe in and go like that. There you go. But this. So I'm just going to keyframe this up now. This, my friend. So every time I speak, I just send me up there and add a keyframe. Is breakfast. When I say breakfast, that's the end one there. Go out a little slightly, put in a keyframe, and then the last keyframe is going to be zoomed all the way out to tiny planet like that. Okay, and then we go to the end, and now we can export it. So we export it, we go to the uh, wherever we're going to put the thing, which is in Lederhosen Challenge and today's date, and say open. And then I'm going to go up to the highest bitrate, which is 200, remove grain, and start the export. So that will write that video to disk and we can whilst that's doing it we can go over here and take the second one which is a time lapse so this is one where it just goes fast so if I play a little bit of that you'll see that we're scoffing away there and uh, what I'm going to do is again put it down to 16 at uh, to 9 by 16 and this time I usually start like way out so I put in a keyframe, uh, a beginning, and a keyframe, and go straight to like that. That looks pretty good. And then come straight in. So in the next keyframe, I'll go to fisheye and go out slightly that looks pretty good and then I'll leave it there for a little bit put another keyframe in 
and then the next keyframe I go and look out to see like that put a keyframe in do the same again with the the one degree there uh, yeah, one degree I think is better so you can just type in one as well there you go and now I want to move across to here put in a keyframe and then just before the end I want to come back round to us and zoom all the way out again but I need the tiny planet to get everything there you go and that should be the end of that one cool so close that one go back to the beginning again change this one slightly so that it's the same as the outgoing one and see what it looks like there you go so now we can just get rid of that one as well go up to here remove the grain start the export and that will export okay then we'll come back and put it all together This is going to be 2022 minus 03. So, this is my event here, and I'm going to import the media. And I'm already in leader hosen there, so it's going to be this one here. And we're going to leave all the files in place and create keywords, and that'll bring everything in that folder into here. And we can uh, make these smaller or bigger, depending on what you want. That looks okay. So what we have, we got these little quick time movies, and we got an MPEG-4 movie, and we got all these other little movies here, and that's including the screen recording that we just did. Uh, this recording is not there yet, so you'll be able to see here that. Uh, this is the behind the scenes bit and this is the bit that we're doing today so that's pretty cool good so what we need now is to find the first one which is this one and uh, just skim through this and if we start a new project and just call this diet day 52 and it'll automatically take the correct settings. So what I then do is I start from the beginning. I go into my assets. And in assets, I go and put in the music. So I've already selected the music. That puts in the music here. And then I'll finish where I'm talking. And I'll pick the range tool and reduce that to t minus 12 decibels so if we play that back it's the 1st of March 2022 and this is day 51 of the diet so you can see that's the edited one has come in now and we can start putting all the other stuff next to it so what I typically do first though is I add this connected clip which is the, the title, Timothy Dowd and Day 50. And I've got to change that to Day 51. 50 minus O-N-E and 1. And go back. And that changes it there. It's the 1st of March 2022 and this is Day 51 of the diet. So and then I go back to the beginning again and add in the overlay this is the overlay at the bottom that just says youtube.com so now we can see they both it's come the in 1st of March 2022 and this is day 51 of the diet as you can see 
day 51 starts a new era. It's now muesli. So, uh, he's talking about muesli there. I say he, it's me, but there you go. And now we've got uh, some footage, quick time movies of muesli. So let's have a look at this one. Uh, this is a slow motion footage. So there's a slow motion footage of that one. Okay, that looks pretty good, but here's the other one. That's a better one, I think. So I'm going to take the second one here, and I'm going to connect this. And that connects it up there, but I want it down one. There you go. So now let's see about the spacing. As you can see, day 51 starts a new era. So I'm going to say, I want it to come in when it says era. So I'm going to move this slightly back. And I'm going to put this one. That's, that's okay where it is. That's perfect where it is. So. It's the 1st of March, 2022, and this is day 51 of the diet. As you can see, day 51 starts a new era. It's now muesli for breakfast and fruit. The sun is... So when I'm talking about the sun now, I want this to finish. So I'm just going to trim this to that length. But if you say, well, I don't like the start and the end of this, that's not a problem. Yeah. It's now music. It starts too fast and then there's maybe the sun is shining. too much stuff on it. So what I want to be able to do is to position the head over here and then press T, that'll give me the trim tool. And this is showing the in and out points and I can drag the footage now left and right to give me in and out points. So basically are very similar so 51 starts a new era it's now muesli for breakfast and fruit the sun is shining so okay so that's a bit jolty so I'm gonna select this and put a transition in command T my that's like a cross dissolve 51 starts a new era it's now muesli for breakfast and fruit the sun is shining Okay, so that's enough of that. Now all I want to do is to fill out the rest up until the one minute mark. So basically after I've shown the sun and everything, it says this is breakfast. Then what I'll do is I'll pop into the fast motion one. So we'll just append that one. And then I want to go to the wide shot. I think that's a good wide shot. Like this one. I think I think you brought it in twice, so I'm just going to add that one. And after that, I'm going to put dinner. So this is dinner. Oh, I'm going to show that one, I think. Yeah, a slow motion of dinner there. So I'm going to append that one. That's way too long, but don't worry. And then at the end of it, I'm going to put this one at the end. And then I'm going to put the daytime shot, the sunset shot, and the nighttime shot. So you see it's way too long now. So let's have a look. So what I'm going to try and do is uh, shorten these so that it'll come in with the music here. And so let's look at this. Friends, so I notice now that the uh, this is the where the volume ramps back up to zero. I'll do it like that. Is breakfast. So you can see that was a nice transition. So. And you can also see, listen to the beat, dum, 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 boom. So if I zoom into this area here, 
you'll see that this starts here so I want to bring this in but I don't want to cut anything off so I'm just going to select this and go to automatic speed and then just pull this back slightly there you go so what it did is just sped it up a little bit more and uh, so that this change changes on the beat so if we zoom back out you see it comes in on the beat and goes out on the beat. Here's breakfast. Okay, so what we've got to do is we've got to shorten this one up as well. So Here's breakfast. So I want it to change here, so I'm just going to shorten this one because it's a still. And as you can see it's wide and it's not filling the frame. So I'm actually going to fill, fill the frame. And then go to the beginning here. Select it and now I'm going to put a, a keyframe on the position X and Y. And I'm going to just slightly move it out of frame. Then go to the end and move it back in. So that just gives it a little bit of movement. So it's not like a... And you see that moves back to there. So... the beat again so I want it to be that long and now I want to trim this beginning and end to make it look good so I will just want the mojito there there you go so it'll end up looking like Boom. so this is the wide shot again so we'll fill the frame here do the same again but move the other direction now so I'm going to go to the beginning of the frame put a keyframe here but bring it out this way so I'm just going to be slightly out of one side and then bring it to the end and bring it back into focus there that should be pretty good and then actually went the wrong way didn't it I don't like that I don't like that that didn't look nice so we will reset those parameters and go to the beginning and set a keyframe I'm just coming slightly and go to the end and move slightly more. That's about it. Just a slight movement. I like that. Yep. Now these two, I'm going to put one on top of the other and make them the same length going out to the end here and then pick those both and make those fit the frame so fill the frame okay so you're actually going to be seeing this top one and you can't see the bottom one because it's been hidden by the top one so what we do we start at the beginning and we listen for the beat and there's the last blink so I will take the opacity all the way down to reveal the one underneath and then go back to the first frame and bring the opacity back up. Now what that does, it puts a keyframe at the right spot so it will gradually 
disappear. And what I did is I added the keyframe for 100% at the beginning. And then by the time it gets to the end, so when that last bling goes, then we're back, we can see the bottom one here. So what I'm gonna try and do now is just go back slightly. So I can see them both and make sure they're lined up and they're not. So I usually take the bottom one and I move the bottom one slightly and then up slightly and back this way. So that's usually pretty good. So if we now skim this over, that's pretty cool. Okay, and because I've moved it, I'm going to have to just up this to, let's say, 105%. And we'll do the same with this, 105%, and they should be in perfect alignment now. There you go. That's fine. So what we're going to put the end on now. So we've got our assets and we put the subscribe and we'll just connect that and pull this back. So they all end together. And then I bring the music back slightly to about 58 and a half seconds because they're going to be less than a minute. These things you see. So now if we go back to the beginning, it's the 1st of March, 2022. And this is day 51 of the diet. As you can see, day 51 starts a new era. It's now muesli for breakfast and fruit. The sun is shining. There are people in the pool. Or they were a minute ago. Lago Mera is still in mist, but we can see the mountains defined pretty well. But this, my friends, is breakfast. Okay, now the next thing I do is over this portion here, I usually add a caption and I use a plugin called M Freeze Frame Comic from Motion VFX. And this is going to be, I use this one tonight and say connect. And that'll connect the whole thing over. Now, because I want this to be a video, not a title, I'm gonna assign the video role video. And then when I export it all, it'll go out with the video and not as a separate file, which I don't want. So I go to the middle of this. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring this down slightly. And I'm going to change the name here to left over. And then rice. It's actually pork and rice, pork and rice. So I'm going to change the color of that to my yellow. And I'm going to change the extrude color to black. Actually, I'll do dark blue. And I'm going to change the shape color to my red and then I'm going to increase the shape size a little bit down move the shape over to here like this a little bit bigger leftover pork rice and the thing I'm going to turn off there is the Oh, no, that's fine. That's fine. Leftover pork rice. Okay, and uh, 
just move it here. Now I'm just going to turn this off for a second and I'm going to pick a little spot to attach it to. So I'm going to select the bottom frame here and add a tracker and the tracker is massive here. I'm going to bring it down and I'm going to track this little bit of rice here. There you go, press analyze. That should analyze that freeze frame there and track that piece of meat and rice. And then it will go backwards as well. So it's doing it in each direction. There you go. So now if I turn this back on and I go to transform, I can connect this title with the object track I just did. And now press done and it should do that. Perfect. So we're nearly done. This is practically the end. I just connect, select everything and group them together in a final mix. And because I don't want it to go over minus 6 dB, I take a limiter and stick it on there and then I go and set up the limiter parameters so I don't want it to go over 6 dB minus 6 sorry uh, the release time I found is at 370 is good I go into the legacy with soft knee on and typically that makes it too quiet it's the 1st of March 2022, and this is day 51 of the diet. So what I'll do is I'll bring this up 6 dB. Probably sounds weird, but uh, you'll see the difference now. March 2022, and this is day 51 of the diet. As you can see, day 51 starts a new... So that's pretty cool. That's done. So now we go back to the um, the project and we export the file. So this file will make sure the settings is video and audio H.264. That's for that's for YouTube. You can do in any of these, but these are massive. So H.264 is very good. And then the roles, we separate the files. We should have three, we do. One is all the videos, one is all the audio, and one is the music. So we split those three up. It's usually around about 200 meg. And then we'll save these out to uh, the same file here, but we'll put it in a new folder called sequence, or SEQ, I usually put it. So we'll save that out. So that'll take a little bit of time to render, so we'll be right back. So we're back in the room and we can go to this file into sequence and see that the three files have been created. This one is just the video with no sound. This is the dialogue. It's the 1st of March 2022, and this is day 51 of the diet. As you can see, day 51 starts a new era. As you can hear on that one, there's a little bit of hiss or hum in the background. We can get rid of that later. And this is the music. And that's pretty clean. That's pretty clean, so we don't need that. So we're going to get these three into a different program. The program we use here is called Descript. And Descript is a transcription service, but it also does video and audio editing, so which is pretty cool. And Descript's coming up. Tip of the day, let's get rid of that. And then we go into the project I've got called Lifestyle. 
and I add the files from the computer. So basically what it's going to do is going to add these sequence files, these three, to this project. And if we look in the project files, we'll see they've come in. So day 51 we're looking for. Uh, 52, sorry. Here we go. Day 52. And this is the dialogue, which we'll should put studio sound on it, and we'll transcribe the file at the same time. And we shall say Tim is the speaker. So the whilst that's studio sounding, and we'll take the all these three and we'll create a multi-track sequence, which puts them all back together again. Sound on top of the video, on top of the music. And here it is. And we can change that to day 52. Why is day, why is day 51 not there? I think it was day 51, wasn't it? Oh, we haven't done day 51 yet. Oh my God. That was clever. So anyway, so now we create a composition. It's actually 51, so I've just named it wrong. So I'll just rename this to 51. I did put 51 in there, didn't I? It's the 1st of March, 2020. I did. And this is day 51 of... And as you can hear now, it sounds a little bit better. So. It's the 1st of March, 2022, and this is day 51 of the diet. Now, it's got this wrong diets and then as yum. So I've got to go in here and just edit this one. It's 51 of the diet, correct. I'm going to wait until it changes down the bottom here. There you go before I go and then as yum is basically me just saying zoom which isn't really a word but I can put it in Z H O O O M question mark uh, exclamation mark so that will put as yum in as zoom there you go and if we play it from here you'll see that this one ends we'll just move that one out so about there. So, start from the beginning again. It's the 1st of March, 2022, and this is day 51. And they've got 51 as two items there, so we'll just edit that to be 51. Wait for it to end. 51 of the diet. There you go. As you can see, day 51 starts a new era. It's now muesli for breakfast and fruit. The sun is shining. There are people in the pool. What we were a minute ago. I go, Mayor is still in mist. See, well, I go is still in mist, so Lagomera. It doesn't like that one either, which is La Gomera. So, start by pool. Pool. What we were a minute ago. My go mayor is still in mist, but we can see the mountains defined pretty well. But this, my friends, is breakfast. I'll just leave the is then. So we've got to select all these now and add in the fancy captions. And that should play. It's the first of March, twenty twenty. Let's show a bigger version of this. Bring this out. So it's it's bringing in the things. Mm -hmm. huh? And this is day fifty-one of the diet. Mm -hmm. There you go. And then what we like as well is to 
select that again and add in this time a waveform. Go to the beginning. It's the 1st of March 2022 and this is day 51 of the diet. As you can see, day 51 starts a new era. It's now muesli for breakfast and fruit. The sun is shining. There are people in the pool. Oh, they were a minute ago. La Gomera is still in mist, but we can see the mountains defined pretty well. But this, my friends, is breakfast. That's the end of that one. So now we publish the whole thing. Export to video. Export. We pick the spots where we want it to go. Lederhosen in the first and save. And that my friends just needs to be uploaded to YouTube ready for tomorrow morning. Eight o'clock. <laughs>